Hello there, Dr. Sheep here. Welcome back to their Minecraft Let's Play episode 41. Or 42. 42, my bad. Episode 42. I'm your host, Dr. Sheep. Please like, comment, share, and subscribe so you don't miss a single Minecraft Let's Play today. So in the previous episode, we finished our item sorter, quote-unquote, for the mine. Uh, some last-minute details need to put on there, but those aren't that necessary until we actually start to uh do work <laughs> with it uh something that is necessary though is trying to figure out what the next project is and so i left it up to you and i got some responses thank you thank you i see the minecraft series is doing the best compared to the other series so uh is doing better now uh compared to how it has been uh, the last episode got seven views so that's pretty good um Wow, I must have this mic on really loud because I can kind of hear feedback. <laughs> like, uh, when you go, I can hear that in the things. And I'm like, because it's really loud for you guys. So, of course, I'm going to hear it. Anyways, so, and uh, the water bottle was about the only person that commented back. So, please leave your comments for what you want me to do next. And he said to do biome stuff and just, like, clean things up. Uh, so, it's not just random builds. And I completely agree. I'm not good at biome modification. However... I do like the terraform, and we just do need to do some organizing. So today, we're going to do that. We're going to go... We're not going to move items today. <laughs> I want to move items. We're not going to do that. Uh, we're going to chop down all these damn trees. Most of them, anyways. Chop them all down. Build a bunch of chests. And then we'll go from there. Do, do I even have a, an axe? I do. Uh, we can put all this iron back. We don't need that anymore. Do, 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 do. Okay, so today is a very exciting... So, so it's just like, might as well get into all the uh, talky-talky. Uh, today is a pretty exciting day. Uh, I finished another class. That leaves me with just three classes left. Um, yesterday was also an exciting day. It's just been very exciting. This week has been... Very exciting, and I've just also been sick all week. I, I kid you not, I have been sick all week. Um, so, uh, okay, we'll, we'll tell a sick story before I get into the uh, exciting stuff. So, Sunday, I woke up. This is after the Josh fight. I think I talked about this on uh, one of the videos. I woke up with shoulder pain. I was like, oh, that's not good. And then by the end of the day, it kind of gone away. It was still there, but, like, it wasn't that bad however i woke up uh i mean by the end of the day it wasn't that bad but i also kind of had a bit of a stomach ache and i was like hmm, was it from all the food i ate maybe I, I wasn't really sure um well anyways <laughs> yeah this item sorting system is not done there's a glass bottle section i know there is or, did I not build a glass bottle section? Or is that just supposed to be the glass? Uh, that might just be with the glass. <laughs> Whoops. Okay. Well, anyways. um, Where was I? No, we never did make a cookie. We had this cookie farm, but never made a cookie. Oh, well. Um, so. It... <sighs> Melting. So I was like, oh, that's strange. I don't know why I'm feeling, not feeling. You know, I was like, so the next day, um, I took a hot shower, went and played golf with Rondo. I don't know why I'm going this way. My bed is over here still. I went and played golf with Rondo, took a hot shower, and the pain in my shoulders was gone. Okay? So, but I kind of had a stomachache all day. And I was like, hmm, that's strange. And then Tuesday, it got bad. Like, I, I was able to go to class, but, like, halfway through my last class of the day, Econmetrics, I I couldn't do it. I was just like, this is awful. So I texted my manager, I didn't go to work. And I felt better uh, Wednesday, and I felt a lot better uh, yesterday. And today I feel pretty damn good, so I don't know why I'm doing just little bits. I need to do the whole thing because 
Despite the fact that I put this here, it's not staying here. I just need bamboo ASAP. So we can start working on the uh, the tree farm. The tree. Oh, about vomited. Saying the term tree farm. Yeah, so we're going to build that. Uh, just because I need a reliable source of charcoal for torches because that's what I used to light up everything and a tree <clears throat> farm <clears throat> is necessary and if you're wondering whoa that's a lot of okay <laughs> if you're wondering why I'm vomiting at the idea of a you know what uh, it's because I don't like building them in survival minecraft you don't need to. Look at look at all the trees around me. Well, usually I build it in a forest biome, not a uh, a savanna biome. And so, yeah. Uh, and savanna trees are a pain in the butt. Usually you're in a forest, so you just go and chop down the forest and call it good. I always kind of like the... Uh, I don't like the idea of deforestation in real life, but deforestation in Minecraft is kind of fun. In my opinion. <laughs> Sounds horrible. I'm a horrible person. <laughs> Yeah, deforestation in Minecraft. Woohoo! <laughs> Jesus Christ. Oh, the, oh, the sweet sounds of death. I thought there was a crafting table in here. Hose! Where's the crafting table? I thought there was a crafting table in here. There isn't, apparently. Uh, I know where there's a crafting table. In the Oreo. Just poor sheep. It's <laughs> just been left there. Oh. Yeah, yeah, I kind of just leave stuff half finished. But, you know, what are you supposed to do, right? Holy crap, six stacks. Uh, what well, we also now just have. More bamboo than God, and more scaffolding than God, so... Uh, I'd say we're pretty set up. Let's go... Let's go put this in a chest here real quick. Oh god, can you just ride the horse around? We're gonna do all this running around today. Back and forth, back and forth. Yeah, so, yeah, I was sick for a good portion of the week. And, um wasn't pleasant at all and so yeah I had to I didn't go I only went to work once this week I'm not going to work today not because I'm sick well yeah not because I'm sick but because I um oh shoot I missed one not because I'm sick but because I have a thing tonight and Back to why this week is exciting. So today is uh, finals week. Uh, not finals week. Dead week. It's dead week, not finals week. Next week's the finals week. It's dead week. However, one of my classes, uh, he canceled his final. He didn't cancel, but he made it optional. And he's like, if you're comfortable with your grade, uh, you can, you don't have to take the final. Then you can stay with this. I have like a 90.93. I'm not even going to bother to take the final because I'm not going to study for it anyways. So I was like, Cool. One last thing I have to do. Um, I forgot how this, this scaffolding works. This is one of the coolest blocks they've ever added. You know, I know, I know a lot of people criticize it because you need string and bamboo. But it's it's very nice. I, I, I really do enjoy it. Why am I using that? Yeah, it makes it super easy, especially for jungle trees, which is like funny because that's where you get bamboo is jungles. So, yeah, I I realistically don't need any more bamboo. 
Which is the funny part. I, uh, that one little stack of bamboo is enough because I have enough scaffolding to, to suffice. For basically forever. Six stacks is plenty. Gotta make sure you get everything. Chopping down jungle trees. One of my, uh, favorite activities, actually. I don't know why. I, uh, I guess, you know, it just reminds me of... So, back in the day, you used to be able to do, um... Modified worlds. Not modified. Not modified in the way you think, but, like... Uh, you could go and modify ore placements and stuff. And so, I'd make, uh, these things called OP survivals. Where you would go... And make just basically you have unlimited like you don't like getting diamonds and stuff is not a problem. I mean get diamonds not I mean mining for diamonds is not a problem. Mining for anything except for coal is not a problem because you don't need coal. You just need uh because you don't need coal. You don't need it. It's not. You can you can make charcoal, which yes I know is a little more expensive, but yeah. So anyway, uh. I just didn't give myself coal. I also got rid of andesite, diorite, dorite, because I hate those and I don't need those. And so those are all basically all the way at the bottom of the world. Anyways, I, mo I and so you just had unlimited everything, and I called it OP Survival. And I wanted to do a series on it. Like, that was like, I was going to do three series of Minecraft back in the day so like a regular minecraft series like this bed uh skyblock and then op survival well you know fast fast forward several years into the future when i was actually able to do this you know now living my dream again to finally do my dream except for you know i'm not getting paid for it but still my dream is to do this um it uh oh you can't do that anymore you can roll it back to 1.7, but you don't, uh, which, no, 1.8, no, 1.9, 1.9, I believe. You can roll, you can go and do, you can go and make 1.9. That's not an issue. You could go back to 1.9, roll back, make a world to 1.9, and you can get all of this. And you can... You can go and you can do. You can build. You can go and make yourself an OP survival world. However, when you update it to soon to be 1.17, uh, you lose. You lose it. You lose everything. It's all. I mean, you, know, you lose it, but it stops generating. So I, I, I thought maybe, maybe I, um, I find a really cool 1.17. nine seed oh shoot oh my god since when do they not require ahaha i just these seeds are i love freaking scaffolding this is one of the coolest freaking blocks they've ever added <laughs> I, I kid you not. I, you know, I, a lot of people ridiculed it, like I said, but I, I love scaffolding. It's, it's awesome. I never get to use it because I never have bamboo. And so, but anyways, so yeah, if you want, maybe for 1.17, maybe since it is a caves and cliffs update, maybe we start uh, OP survival let's play or something. I don't know. So we roll back up. We make a world to 1.8. Maybe it was 1.10. I think it was 1.9. I think it was 
I make an OP survival world. And then we update to 1.17. And we do it. Let me know. Let me know. Would you like to see an OP survival let's play? I, I, I have no problems doing it. I would love to do it. Uh, yeah, and then you would use villagers to get uh, enchanted stuff. Because the enchanting was still difficult because you had to get XP. Well, because the enchanting stuff, you still had to get XP, which was difficult. You could literally go defeat the Ender Dragon day one. Like, the hardest part was getting enchantments. Because uh, you could go defeat the Ender Dragon day one. Although, one way of getting a lot of XP, I also modified dungeons. And how often dungeons spawn. Oh. <laughs> Made them spawn very frequently. I made dun yeah, I made dungeons spawn very frequently, and so... You, you could go and get a good amount of music discs and stuff, and you could also make a lot of mob farms if you wanted to. So, again, I would, I'm down to do an OP survival. But anyways, why is this week so awesome? I never freaking answered that question. So, um, I had this job interview last Friday that I've talked about in the, let's, and they never got back to me. And so I emailed them Wednesday, like, hey, well, what's going on here? They called me yesterday. Uh, they left me a message, I called them back, and they're like, so, you didn't get the job, but that's because we changed what the job is, like, what we want. Um, however, there's this other job in the town that you live in, would you be interested in that one? I was like, and they told me what job it was, and I was like, I actually thought about applying for that one, uh, this week, but I've been, uh, I've been sick, and so I never got around to it. Um, and... And so she's like, well, we can certainly set up an interview. You don't even have to apply. And I'm like, yes, I will. I will I'll take it. <laughs> and so uh, they set up a, an interview for me uh, t Tuesday, next Tuesday. Which is just, just the best thing in the world. So now I have a second interview with this company. Uh, and I'm ecstatic. So. We'll wait and see if this pans out. Oh my god. Why do you have so much dirt on us? I don't remember why was it growing so many jungle trees. I think it was because I wanted... Um... Oh, horse. I think I was growing the jungle trees because I wanted. Sugar. Not sugar. Uh, cocoa beans without having to go to the jungle biome to do that. One. Two. Three. Four. There we go. Oh, they were on. I just had them off. Okay. Hello, cat. Meow. Skit, skit, skit. Skit, skit. Skit, skit. Sorry, I'm not talking. I was, uh, it was, I was actually just thinking. <sighs> so, yeah, this, uh, this week was interesting. Other than being sick, uh, for, like, the first time in a while, um. Oh, I started watching Suits. Suits is pretty good. But anyways, no, I finished two classes this week. Uh, this one class, I call it the hippie class. This is an entrepreneurship class, uh, that I took. Uh, I finished it this week. Uh, today, I literally just finished my class on natural resources. Um, I literally just turned in the final right before doing this. I said it's going to take me two hours. Guess how long it took me? Exactly two hours. So, yeah. I then set... Uh, so, then my other goal for today is, before I go do this awards ceremony thing, 
is um, I want to do this Minecraft Let's Play and then upload the podcast parts and then maybe also this Minecraft Let's Play. And I said that that all together that's gonna take me like two hours. So this is gonna be a half hour as suggested, and then yeah, we'll do everything else. Yep, and then we're just gonna watch Suits the rest of the day, which is super exciting. That's what, that's all I wanted. And then next week, I have a test Monday. Um, yeah, so next week I have a test Monday, and that'll finish that class. I then have to go watch some presentations uh, Wednesday. That'll finish that class, and then he's also uh, this, this. Then for the next day, I have a test at ten. However, the professor says he's going to give us the uh, test the day before, and then we have until noon the next day to finish it. And we're like, heck yeah! Also means he's going to make it longer and more difficult, but that's okay. Yeah, and so then I'll just finish that test Wednesday. Might as well, and then I'm done. I am done with my senior year of college. I'm just done with college. Then I just gotta wait for all the uh, old response. Then I gotta wait for all the scores to come in. To see if I passed. I'm sure I will. Uh, and then I get my diploma next Saturday. Or I guess this Saturday for you guys. And then I'm done. Have the job interview Tuesday. And once I, and if that goes well, and they're like, yeah, we'll, uh, we'll offer you a job. Uh, I'll have a new job, I'll, and life will be set. I'll be ready to go. I'll be ready to be an adult. Literally, this, is, this could all come together next, uh, next Friday, because that's when I'll see all the grades in, is Friday at noon. So, literally Friday, and like, say they say like, oh, we'll let you know at the end of the week. I could literally find out Friday, hey, yeah, you've got a new job. Um, I could literally find out next Friday, hey, you have a new job. Oh, I was not anticipating my, uh, my axe to break there. Not gonna lie. Wasn't anticipating that. I think I've got more axes. I think I do. We'll go check. That's crazy, you know, when, you, uh, when you're mining, like, stone and stuff, and you're mining with your pickaxe, and it breaks, you're like, well, yeah, look how much I mined. And then you're mining, like, trees and stuff, you're like, oh, my axe broke, why did that break? And you're like, oh, I cut down. Look how many trees I just cut down, <laughs> you, know? you know? Look at look at how many damn trees I just cut down. <laughs> so... Uh, pff, my brain is melting. What I can move? Oh, new new axe. Nope, but we have emeralds, so we'll just go buy a new axe. All right, what you schmucks uh, sells me my axes? Who is it? I need an axe. Efficiency two, that's pretty good. What do you sell? What do you sell absolutely nothing. You're a farmer. What do you sell? Unbreaking one. Um you know what? Let's go efficiency two. Oh, that's unbreaking. Can we not can we just can we just stop humping each other for one minute, please? So I can examine what it is that you're selling. You, this is... Yes! Unbreaking... No, wait. Un, this is unbreaking, too. Where's the efficiency guy? Or was there no... Or was there never an efficiency guy? No! Damn it! Get out of here! There. Jesus. There we go. It's an expensive axe. I only have five levels. I don't think I'd be able to combine the efficiency two and the unbreaking two. 
uh, axes. I would like to be able to, but I don't think I... I don't think I can. Eesh. Got to buy some more. We're going to have to sell some crops here one day. Is it dark already? No, not really. Yeah, kind of. There's so much stuff over here. There's so many trees over here. It's just ridiculous. It's going to take a while. Um, if I have time, I'll grind this weekend. I say that. I never do, but... I'm watching suits, so I, I definitely won't. I'm sorry. <laughs> so. Mm -hmm. Oh, it's dark again. It's getting dark outside. It's time to sleep. This commentary and gameplay is just a boring piece of junk. Oh, 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 oh. It's just as boring as you could probably predict. I just want to say hello. 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 Subscribe. <laughs> I should really start getting better at saying subscribe during it. But hey, we're at 340, so thank you guys. That's awesome. I wasn't... I, I don't know why we're growing like that, but I, I'm not against it, you know. So let's just let's keep, let's keep pushing. Let's get to 400. Oh yeah, today's April 30th. The last day we we can get to 400. So if we can get uh, 60 subs today, you know, that'd be be pretty cool. <laughs> but uh, for May, you know, if we can get 160 subs, we can stay on track to getting a thousand by the end of the year. Eh? Yeah. Boy can dream. Boy can dream. We gain about 17 to 10 subs per ye uh, per month, which at that rate means it's about 100 subs per year, which is really slow. Which is a little over 100 subs per year, which is which is good. It's it's good growth. I mean, it, I I wish I could I would have I couldn't have dreamt of that. Uh, I I dreamt of that you know, when I was younger, but I mean. I... You know, it's that exponential growth that Phil and I talk about. And it's uh, what Phil and I wanted. You know, it, it, it's faster than anything we had done before. But it's just not that fast. Still pretty good. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna argue. I, I'm not gonna, not gonna complain. It's, it's good growth. Good. Finally get all these trees out here. Looks nice. Yeah, so once all these trees are out of here, we'll be in a good position. You know, these spruce trees are kind of like, uh... You know, they should add redwoods. I don't know, I know, I know. It's kind of a ridiculous question. They just added uh, azalea trees. And I don't know if azalea trees... I think they just use oak as their trunks. I'm not sure. Uh, so I'll be excited to see what kind of color they uh, they add. I hope they're kind of like... I hope they're more of a red. And actually, you know what I want them to add? It's, well, I was going to say a stain. But it doesn't really work for something like... Uh, dark oak, which is already super dark. And so, like, we just have the variances of... Of the different woods, and that gets you your stain. So, I guess I, I'm not gonna... I'm not gonna ask for stain. Because how do you make dark oak any darker, you know? <laughs> you can't. So, unless you make it black... But, you know. Now I gotta do all these birch trees. The last one. I, I, I'm debating whether I want to get rid of this one or not. It's a really nice tree. And I really like it. And I'm really debating whether I want to get rid of it or not. 
This is like a this is a good tree. I, I like the look of it. I don't know. It all depends on how we're gonna build this this farm. Oh, threw up my mouth a little bit. It was fake. I know. I, I'm joking, but <laughs> I don't like them. Phil, uh, Phil, Will, and Kyle like them a lot. I don't like them. I think they're stupid. Like, well, didn't you just build one with all this? Yes, I did. Technically. All I did was plant trees, though. So that I could build my house and have charcoal. That's all these were. Yeah. Yeah, it's uh, oak trees. Oak trees are the annoying ones. Because they, you can get the big trees, which are really annoying. Uh, spruce trees are, can be annoying. Uh, birch usually aren't too bad. Birch is a... I like birch. See, I'm always conflicted between whether I want a birch tree farm for jungle... Not for jungle. For uh, charcoal or a jungle tree farm. Jungle tree farms can get you a lot less... Can get you a lot more wood... Per area than a birch tree farm but you have to crime crime climb all the way up to the top to 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 mine the tree so and, well, they also used to require a My brain is going blank here bone meal but they don't require bone meal anymore so it's hard. Uh, these spruce ones, uh, they're pretty good. You know, they, they just grow up like this and there's nothing to them. You know, there's not... I don't know. There's not really a lot of... There's no problems to them. I think this is one of the coolest things I've ever had. With the, the Mega Tega is probably one of my, Mega Tiger, Tega, whatever you want to call it, is probably one of my favorite biomes. It's just, it's something you don't see a lot. Uh, the podzil is a really interesting thing. All the mossy cobblestone uh, boulders everywhere. That's always really that, that's a really cool feature. It's a really cool biome. It's just, it's it it presents just a lot of really interesting blocks. Um, it's definitely underlooked. And oh, and it snows, so you can always uh, make an ice farm with it if you want. So yeah, it's uh, hmm. I I've always liked the jungle, but in recent years, uh, I don't know. Jungles, jungle is like good to spawn next to a jungle in a forest because then you just have unlimited wood, and you don't have to do what we're gonna do in the next episode <laughs> because we're out of time in this episode because all we did was mine trees. I'm sorry if that's boring. Well, I didn't. I don't know what to do, all right? The step one is to remove all the trees, and I also, you know, I just... I'm, I'm binging the show, and so all I want to do is binge the show. I don't want to do anything else. As much as I enjoy playing Minecraft, I, I just want to binge the show and... <sighs> yeah, it's, it's, it's the double-edged sword. Oh, how high do you want to go? 28 blocks, is that high enough? 28 blocks, what? No. It's higher than that. Significantly higher than that. Oh, yeah. Here we go. Oh, yeah. Anyways, I would like to thank you all for watching. Please like, comment, share, and subscribe. New Minecraft Let's Plays every Monday, 11 a.m. Central Time. Uh, so, the next episode, we will continue to chop down all these trees. Uh, leave a comment if you want me to chop down the big tree if you want me to leave it there. Otherwise, uh, we're going to start coming up with an idea for... 
a farm that will also probably require me to do a lot of, well, deforesting and a lot of terraforming too. So let me know. Let me know. Wow, this is a really cool spot to be in. I I love being up this high in this in this world. There's a lot of stuff going on here. A lot of stuff. Very, ton a lot of things in this world. Yeah, I think that's the coolest, that iron farm. You know. And, uh, good night. Hello there. Actually, it's more of a goodbye. Um, this is my Minecraft outro. Anyways, make sure you subscribe so that we can hit our, our uh, 10k goal so we can plant 100 trees for subs for trees. Otherwise, stick around for the next 20 seconds to give me that sweet, sweet watch time. <laughs>